Sunny day. Thought I'd bring you a video. Uh, today I thought we'd work on something a bit different. So I thought maybe we could try something out like rebound. The person who controls the boards controls the game. I remember Bill Russell saying how he used to get so many rebounds, and you know he averaged like 20 rebounds, some stupid number like that, uh, throughout his career. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Well, Chamberlain, of course, who has like the most rebounds in the NBA game. I'm pretty sure at 55. So that's pretty insane. Of course, you have the modern talent like uh, Kevin Love and of course the guy from the 90s who everybody loved to hate and hated to love. My main man, Dennis Robin. This dude was a beast. And you know how beast he is at grabbing rebounds if you've seen my How Not To Be A GM Seattle Supersonic series. Sorry if you can't hear me, it's because there's some work going on in the background and shit. So there's going to be some theoretical work how to grab some rebounds, all that type of good stuff. So how to grab rebounds is just literally straightforward. Uh, I'm going to give you some really easy theory behind it, so here's a quick practice. See that rebound right there? It's straightforward. How to rebound is pretty easy. And of course, like the old saying goes, the person who controls the boards controls the game. So I'm going to show you how to do this really straightforward. Line. So let's go check it out. You've seen the old school video of Red on Round Ball, and it's rebounding. That's what it's titled. You'll hear Bill Russell explain how he grabs rebounds. And I really like the way he does this, because it's very straightforward and it's pretty simple. So basically, when you're grabbing a rebound, what you want to do is first things first is box out your opponent. Now boxing out is just straightforward. I'm boxing out my opponent. I like to keep low. And I like to lift up my arm just to make sure he ain't gonna come this way or this way. So I'm cutting him off and I'm sliding my feet to make sure whichever way he goes, he's not going. If you can get in front of your man and box him out, the ball is just gonna be right there. All you need to do is grab it. So how to grab the ball in this scenario is once you're boxing out your man, you're gonna do some sort of tricks. Well, I say tricks, but you're gonna try and like swipe your arms away. Of course, when you're up here, you're gonna try and move your arms, do everything to get you off balance and get the rebound themselves. So what I've learned from Bill Russell with that red on round ball video was, once you're boxing out your man, all you need to do is literally stick out your butt a bit. I know, right? Just, just go with this. Force your man out. Force him out. Force him as far out as you can get. When the ball hits the rim, it's gonna bounce. And once that ball bounces, that's your opportunity to get it. But do not get the ball as soon as it hits the rim. You wanna get the ball as soon as it's coming down off that rim bounce, if you know what I mean. So you shoot, you miss, it hits the rim. It's coming down. Now if you're applying the whole box out, pushing your man away, all you need to do at this point is just lean in. That's it, you don't even need to jump straight up. If you jump straight up, you can also get it. But this makes it easy for you because you box out your man so well. All you need to do is lean in, grab it, that's a rebound. Nothing fancy to it. It's just straight hard work. Robin did it really well. Of course he had like some athletic freaking abilities. So did Bill Russell, uh, Will Chamberlain's height just completely dominated that entire era. He was like, what, 7'1", 7'2", and he just grabbed boards left, right, and center. So that's how Bill Russell did it, that's how Will Chamberlain did it. I'm pretty sure that's how Kevin Love does it as well. All, this, all it is is boxing out, creating space. And if you learn anything, you can learn from these guys who grab rebounds on a regular basis throughout their entire career. That's still how you do your rebounds. So let me know what you guys think. And this can be applied for NBA 2K as well. NBA 2K has some issues with rebounding. I've noticed with people who are above seven foot, or actually, it's people who are above 6'10", actually, that really cannot rebound. It's just some sort of glitch. That means your player is too tall. But if you just use this rule, what I just taught you, box out, force your man out, get the ball on the way down, just lean in, just grab it. That's you, that's you got a rebound. Let me know what you guys want to see next time for these type of tutorial videos. I'm going to try and bring as many as I can. Making sure the ball hasn't rolled down the hill or any shit like that. So yeah, uh, I'm on Facebook, on Twitter, on Instagram, on Vine. Be sure to follow me on all that. Uh, I'm on Twitch TV. I stream live on Twitch TV, so be sure to follow me on that as well. What else am I forgetting? I have a second channel called the AT29 TV, where I post like comedy sketches, some vlogs, some more videos of me playing basketball. So be sure to go check out that channel. It's called the AT29 TV. Link in the description as always. Be sure to go check that out. And of course, share this video with everyone you know who wants to know how to rebound, how to shoot, or how to, I think my last one is how to post up as well. So be sure to share it, and I will see you guys next time. Till then, peace to you, I'm gone.